All right, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan battle video. So about 45 minutes ago, Global got a data download. And since for some reason I'm still up right now, we're going to quickly talk about exactly what this data download entailed. Okay, quick side note for anybody that cares about why I'm not asleep right now like I normally would be at this time. It's because I was binging this new Netflix documentary called the Raincoat Killer, who apparently is the most notorious uh, serial killer in South Korean history. And so far, I gotta say, it's pretty interesting. Um, I would recommend it for anybody that's into that stuff, but obviously uh, it does get quite gruesome at times, so definitely use discretion, okay? But anyways, with that said, getting back to the main topic at hand, which is the global data download, a big shout out to Air Dokkan on Twitter for posting the assets. And this was actually a fairly small data download. There wasn't really that much that was added to the global database, but we did get the new free-to-play Halloween unit, which is this Aider who Dokkan awakens into Aider and 17. And uh, on top of that, we also have this new Murasaki who is not gonna be an obtainable unit, but rather he seems to be the boss that we fight for uh, this new Halloween event where we get the Aider and 17 and also the Dokken Awakening medals for the uh, Aider, which is this right here. And lastly, we have the most interesting part of this data download, which is a brand new Dokkan Festival ticket. Now, most people seem to think that this ticket is for the upcoming Halloween banner, which is dropping in like a day from now. And that would make sense, right? This banner is not going to have any new units. It's just going to have a bunch of, like, fairly new Dokkan Festival units from the last 12 months or so. And even though it is kind of a trap banner, which is what a lot of people are calling it, and I think it's fair to call it a trap banner, but as far as trap banners go, it's pretty good. Because, you know, for newer players who are missing a bunch of these, really good Dokkan Festival category leaders. Um, it's gonna be a fairly valuable banner still. But yeah, a lot of people think this ticket is for that banner, but there's also a different theory out there, which is that this ticket is actually for the Dokkan Festival banner with a new unit that's coming after the Halloween banner, which obviously would be in the beginning of uh, November, right? Like first or second week or so. And that unit is either gonna be the STR Super Vegeta or Tech LR Gogeta. And one piece of information that actually lends some credibility to this theory is the fact that the end date for these tickets is apparently in December. And obviously the Halloween banner won't be around for that long. So the fact that we can use these tickets until December should mean that they're not for the Halloween banner, but rather for another banner that comes later, right? So this is just speculation. Nobody really knows for sure, but we do have these new Dokkan Festival tickets for some kind of a Dokkan Festival banner in the near future. And uh, aside from that, there really wasn't anything else that was added to the global database, obviously. We have some other assets for the Halloween event, like the stages and all that stuff. But uh, as far as units, it's just the free-to-play Aider slash the Aider N17, and also this new Murasaki boss, um, which is not obtainable once again. And uh, that's it. So thank you to Aider Dokkan once again for posting these assets. And before we go, for anybody that hasn't seen this, we do have the details for the Aider and 17. A big shout out to Goresh of course for the translations and uh, starting with their super attack it raises attack for one turn and causes supreme damage with a medium chance to stun the enemy. Passive is attack and defense plus 80%, gains an additional attack plus 80% and damage reduction and chance to perform a critical hit plus 17% when HP is 80% or below. Guard activated against all attacks for the first 8 turns from first appearance, gains an additional attack and defense plus 80% after receiving an attack for 8 turns, and then recovers HP with candy. Links are Courage, Android Assault, Solid Support, Gold Judgment, Infighter, 
uh, tough as nails and shattering the limit and categories are androids and joined forces so um overall a pretty decent free-to-play unit i mean nothing too special i'm sure they will get an extreme z awakening at some point in the future that will make them much better but for now um i wouldn't really expect them to do any kind of crazy damage uh defensively they might actually be a little bit more impressive just because of the guard against all attacks for eight turns and also the damage reduction when you fall below 80 percent hp but outside of that you know their stats are going to be pretty low so um yeah i wouldn't expect too much from them and of course as far as categories go they only have two of them androids and joined forces so uh yeah there you go aider and android 17. oh and one last thing actually we do have the animations for uh, both the aider and also the aider and 17 so i'm gonna quickly play those thank you to kawaii for posting these so let's pause my music and we'll start with the aider first okay here we go All right, so pretty basic, but quite nice for a free-to-play Halloween unit. He runs up, gives them a headbutt and a kick, and uh, there you go. All right, so after that, we have the Aider and 17. And there you have it. Yeah, both animations are pretty short, but I kind of like that because I'm not a huge fan of like super long animations unless they're really, really good. And in this case, they're decent. So I'm fine with them being short. But uh, there you have it, guys. That was today's data download. We got the Aider and 17 coming up. We got the Halloween event, obviously. Got the new Murasaki. Got the uh, Awakening Medals. And then this Dokkan Festival ticket for some banner, possibly the Halloween banner, possibly the banners or one of the banners that comes after. Um, oh, one really cool thing is that we will be able to obtain some of these tickets for free. So everybody will be treated to a couple of free summons, uh, whether it be for the Halloween banner or some other banner. And uh, oh, let me actually turn on the music again. Here we go. And uh, that's going to do it for today's video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. As always, if you liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, have an awesome Awesome day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.